Hey cuties! So today I'm going to be doing a West Edmonton mall haul. I went to Edmonton about two weeks ago. My mom and I mainly went for back to school, shopping, and it, well, my mom did and I did. I am going to get started. I don't know what this is. I'm also sorry that I haven't been making videos a lot lately. I have just started mortician school. I love it. I'm obsessed with it. It's a ton of work, however, so I'm always working, but nevertheless, First place I went is Aeropostale and I got this really cute sweatery shirt thing. A lot of these things are for fall because it's going to be fall right away and that's what I'm going to be wearing to school a lot. This is so nice if you can see the detailing in there. It is going to be see-through so I'll have to wear a tank top under it. So soft. I wish you guys could feel this. And this was 50% off so it was originally $34.50. we went was Aritzia and it was actually my very first time being in an Aritzia because we don't have one in my whole province. Loved everything in there. It's a tad bit more pricey or expensive than your average clothing store. I only got one thing and they wrapped it. That's how you know it's an expensive store because they wrapped it in their own wrapping paper or tissue paper, whatever. I got these leggings. As you guys know, I live in leggings. I'm always wearing leggings. Whenever I do out for the days, your eyes are like, really? You're wearing leggings again? These are more of a gray cheetah one so I can wear them with a lot of different things. They are super good quality leggings. It's back to school and I will probably be wearing these almost every day as you guys know. I love them. Look at them. The next place I went is Bath and Body Works. Because we don't have one in my province, my sister asked me to pick her up three of these soaps. So she wanted Japanese Cherry Blossom, Peach Bellini, and Warm Vanilla Sugar. I pretty well went candle crazy because they came out with their new fall scents. I got two of their big candles, new fall scents. I love them. I think they're two for 30. Oh my goodness. This is cinnamon sugar donut. This smells identical to a cinnamon sugar donut. It's their huge candles. Oh, just smell it. That's all you need to do. I had the marshmallow one in my hand of the big candle and when I smelled this one, I fell in love. I, I fell in love. Like I am obsessed with this scent. The scent is in my heart. But this one is in French baguette and I love the packaging. It's very, very unique. Oh yes, Frenchers. Mm, I love the French. It smells just like butter and I love it. I also got three little tiny mini ones because I love their fall scent so much and I didn't just want to get big candles because they are kind of expensive. So these little ones were three for six. This first one here is in salted caramel or caramel. I don't really know how I even pronounce that usually. This is the one that I had a big candle in but fresh bit fret and French, fresh, French. Baguette stole my heart so I had to get the big one. So I got the small one of the Marshmallow Fireside which smells so good. This one I also had a big one in my hand but then the Cinnamon Sugar Donut stole my heart. Pumpkin Caramel Latte smells so good. One of their newer scents, the Vanilla Buttercream, I absolutely loved and they didn't have any candles, they didn't have any soaps of it, they didn't have anything except hand sanitizers and I really don't need more hand sanitizers because I have a lot. This is probably my all-time favorite scent from Bath and Body Works. I think it beats the French, fresh French baguette? What, what's wrong with me? Then I got two of their lip glosses and these are from their new Halloween collection. Crazy for candy corn because I love candy corn. Sweet and sour lip gloss. I've tried the candy corn. Um, they're a little bit sticky but they smell amazing. I haven't tried this one yet. And I got a candle for 50% off. So I didn't pay full price for this. This was $22.50 and then 50% off of that. So I think that's a really good price for- oh! Smells so good. This one is in the lemon mint leaf and the packaging looks like this. It's a bright neon candle. Next I went to Sephora. I went there for one reason and one reason only. Um, I have a Sephora in my city, however, the Sephora in Edmonton carries YSL. The one in my city does not. I've never tried anything by YSL because it's very expensive. Um, however, I've been eyeing a lipstick, the lingerie pink lipstick for two years. If I've been wanting it for two years and I've tried swatches, I've had samples and I'm obsessed with it so I just got it. If I've been eyeing it for this so long then it's meant to be. I'm wearing it right now so it kind of gives the color away. This is the packaging. It is so sleek. It is such a pretty color. It's 
perfect and it goes on so smooth it's super super creamy I'm not wearing any type of gloss it just glides on you only need like one swipe and it's done I went to forever 21 I did get one clothing item and it looks like this I love this it has it looks very very girly it's pink and gold it has shoulder puffs and the pleats on the bottom are just adorable it says it's an exclusive design for forever 21 sad story. I mean, not the look of it. This is so pretty, isn't it? OMG. And this is what the price tag says. Now, I thought that said 11. I thought it said 1180 and I was like, oh, 11, it's a little bit expensive, but I'll go for it because it looks like, because somebody just messily wrote that on there. It looks like 1180. And after I paid for it, it rang in at $20. Like it's like 1980 or 1880 or something. That is ridiculous. I would have never spent $18 on this. I was wondering why my total was so expensive. It's just really, really, really pretty, but people need to write neater. This one is super pretty because it's stretchy. I love stretchy bracelets. It is very, very cute. It's definitely me. This was $12.80. Are you serious? I seriously needed to look at the prices. I'm so sad. I thought this one said $7.80. This one was $17.80. This isn't like me, you guys. <laughs> All right, positive energy. It's in the past. It was two weeks ago. Let's let's continue with the positive energy. I bought a seventeen dollar bracelet. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity for you guys to be looking at right now. Mhm. Mm seventeen eighty. I thought it said seven eighty when I bought it. These were five eighty. These are love earrings. Really did like them. This bracelet is adorable. This was only five eighty. It also clasps like this. I have a very similar set. I wear these all the time and they're pink and sparkly and these were $12.80. I went to H&M. I love this green dress right here and it has a zipper all the way down. This one is very stretchy and slinky. I love it. So I got another one in this stripey material. I really like this. This is more of a cloth or t-shirt material. I love leggings so much, so I got this pair. It's very, very fun. These are really good quality, like the feeling of them, they're so soft. I live in leggings, as you guys know, so they're pretty well my pants or my jeans to somebody else, so I love them. And then I got some underwear because these were only on sale for a dollar. Cute ones, like one dollar, really. And they're regularly six, so one dollar for those. These like Valentine ones. That was everything at H&M. And then I went to icing. Look at this ring. I was like, I do not care of this price tag. I'm buying it. And it was $16.50, but I, I'm in love with this. Love it. It's so sparkly and it's also stretchy. I just had to find big matching earring hoops, right? Really, this stole my heart. All of their earrings were buy one, get one 50% off. So I bought these and then I got these for 50% off. These are super pretty. I love them. They're awesome, you guys. I love these. I got these for $14.25, these for seven. I stopped in this little tiny boutique in the middle of the mall. I got a little tiny pair of earrings because they're so pretty and they were only $7. Adorable, look at these. Love these. They had so many different cute little cartoon characters and I just got these bunnies. Urban Planet is next. These are just basic stretchy. They're stretchy. That's what I love because that's what fits me well because I'm very short. I'm kind of a weird body type. So these fit me perfectly. These are stretchy, just black pants. I got this really pretty shirt and it ties up at the bottom. You can leave it open or you can tie it. It's very sheer, so I'm gonna have to wear a tank top underneath it, but it'll be perfect for layering for the fall. Love this. Did remind me of Minnie Mouse. style of that shirt just in a different color or color scheme it has a very very bright neon I hope it's showing up in camera it's neon pink and then I got this one similar again with the no sleeves and the buttons and the sheer and the tie at the bottom this tie is very long and I don't know I just loved the gold it looked so classy on This one is more of a jean, sort of like retro-y material. I say retro because I used to wear these when I was little. Ties up at the bottom as well. I think this one is one of my favorites. I love this.
I also got another pair of these stretchy pants. These ones actually don't have a button. They're kind of just slide on or lazy pants is what I call. Um, these are a nice charcoal -y gray. I got this cardigan that I love. So pretty. I love the lace. earrings because they were all 50% off. They're neon, like a greeny yellow. These were originally $4, so I got them for $2. I just love hoops. I went to MAC for one thing. I wanted a specific lipstick. This is the lipstick that I got. I've been eyeing this for so long. This one is in creme de nude. It's a very nice nude. It's sort of a darker nude. There we go. It's right here. I just I'm in love with this. Okay, so that was everything that I got at West Edmonton Mall. And I also went to two different stores that weren't in the mall. The first one is Save On Foods. They sell NYX Cosmetics. And I can't get NYX Cosmetics anywhere in my whole province. So Save On Foods is one of my go-to stores. The first thing is a NYX pencil sharpener. Kind of boring. And there's a perfect spot for the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencils. Because I wear those a lot. So I wanted a sharpener specifically for them. This was $5.99. I got two NYX face products because I've been loving face and foundation. <laughs> this first one is a concealer. My first time wearing a concealer, my first time buying a concealer, my first ever concealer experience. NYX HD. This one is in light. It just looks like this. This was $7.99. I've never ever tried a face primer before or a base. I haven't tried this yet. I've tried the concealer. I've used it and I love it. Here is the primer. It's basically just to prime your face before you put on any uh, powders or foundations or blushes or anything. You guys probably know more about that than me. Um, but this was $17.99. And then I got a Rimmel Mascara just because it was on sale. This was only on sale for $2. This is originally, I think, 10 or more. And it's the Rimmel Mascara, the Lycra Lash Extender. Obviously, I haven't tried it yet, but I'm very excited because it was only $2. Last place I went on my Edmonton journey was Ikea. Ikea is like a home furnishing store. So I got two things from my Ikea for my room because as you guys know, we moved recently and I've been sort of redecorating my room. I got this night light. So the night light looks like this and as you guys know I love anything cute and cartoony and this is just adorable. It has a little tail. You just plug it in and it's supposed to just glow in your room. It's nice and squishy and I love this. If you're interested or if you're fine trying to find it at Ikea it's called the Spolka. Everything there is pretty much in Swedish. I think this was around like $17. The other thing and the last thing in my haul that I got at Ikea is my storage. It's the most beautiful thing ever. I love it. I'm in love with it. It's called the Alex or something like that. I hold all my hair storage on there. I'm gonna switch to a clip of that right now. So here is the storage. I'm sorry about the light. The sun is going down right now, but this is the storage. On top, I hold all of my hair hair things, hair clips and bows, and the drawers are just amazing. They slide so nicely, as you can see. Just slide and slide. So smooth and they hold a lot. Like they go back pretty deep. This is the side of it. Hope you guys have a great day and you liked my haul. So I will talk to you guys later. Thank you for watching. Bye guys.